Hello there, Karan here, and in this video, we are going to talk about the progress function that I have created. Uh, this function shows the progress bar on the CMD screen. So let's quickly run the demo pro demo progress file. So it will show you this kind of progress bar, and after completing the progress, it will automatically remove the bar from the screen so that you can use that space for any other purpose and uh, you can see here we can also make it slow by increasing the maximum point so basically that uh, the progress function needs is the size of the screen and it needs a current progress step and uh, the total number of steps so if you say there are 1000 steps uh, and right now we are at 64th step so it will show you progress according to that and then the first parameter let, let's talk about the parameters of the progress quickly I will open CMD here and uh, let's quickly clear the screen for you I will increase the size of the screen progress and here you can see this function will show CLI command line interface progress bar on the CMD screen it will help you making your program more user friendly and the progress bar will auto disappear on 100 filling the maximum value reach 100% should be here okay no worries progress here is this and uh, yeah the, the syntax is you call the progress then you tell the length of the bar how long it should be if it is more than the length of the CMD screen it will create mess so make sure that it is appropriately according to the length of the screen uh, the length of the screen you can check by mode command mode mode you can check it like that so it tells you that the current screen is 120 column in length and and uh, 9000 in line because of this scroll bar so yeah so you don't care about the height you just care about the columns for now it's bar length and then you tell how many steps are done out of total steps so here are the examples call progress the bar length is 75 and it's 45 steps are done out of 68 so it will automatically calculate the percentage of and it will show on the screen so let's call uh, the progress and here you can see it automatically calculates and shows you that this much is done and the good thing here is that it automatically starts from the beginning and if you want you can add that number of spaces and then say okay disappear uh, uh, this will disappear I will say 68 out of 68 68 steps are done so it's 100 percent complete and it will show you a progress bar in the next line and then disappear so you have an empty line to use so that is uh, how you can easily use it it's very simple to use it does not need any dependencies it is a pure batch function and uh, yeah that's pretty much all you can use this in your projects however you want let's also check about the demo pro demo progress file you see here I am just calling it uh, you don't need to do this actually you can delete that and uh, yeah this call progress so I am calling from 0 to 100 steps and we are incrementing by 1 and it says 77 is the length and then yeah this and this for 1000 steps it all this is doing is just 1000 steps will make it slow 100 steps will make it fast it up, it's up to you how many steps your loop has so in if you are doing this you can also do other tasks in the loop uh, for example this you can add other stuff and while you are doing let's say ram other stuff if the loop is doing other stuff while doing it it will all you can will also be able to show the progress like how many steps are done and yeah that's pretty much all thank you so much for watching if you like uh, our work please consider subscribing to our channel and then yeah i'll see you in the next video bye bye